What starts with a sneeze is one of the most efficient ways to transfer DNA. The influenza virus is traveling down the airways, penetrating the mucus, and then facing its ultimate barrier. The virus needs to overcome the cellular membrane to deliver its DNA to the cytosol. Influenza has developed a fusion peptide for the purpose, mediating the initial contact between the viral and endosomal membranes and eventually triggering the escape. At Lipocalyx, scientists have been using this mechanism as a blueprint to develop an entirely synthetic copy based on high-tech polymers, so-called viromers. As a functional copy of the virus, the synthetic viromers form a larger particle that is taken up by the cells, reaches the late endosome, and does escape under the conditions of a low pH. Once inside the cytosol, the complex disassembles and liberates its cargo for cellular action. This innovative technology is available as the four Kohler named viromers. Easy to use reagents, giving a boost to in vitro transfection and related applications like gene silencing, RNA interference, protein production, or high throughput sequencing. Thanks to researchers who've shared their results with us, Way over 100 cell types are now known to be transfectable using biromers, including challenging ones like primary or suspension cells. But there is more. Biromers can achieve transfection in vivo. Ongoing preclinical work has shown transfection of messenger RNA and expression of transgenes in spleen, liver, muscles, and into the skin. What has started from a virus is now helping researchers to fight diseases in a new molecular way.